away, so take a peek at our elk. It's browned up nicely. As you can see, it's taken up all the oil in the pan. It's a non-stick pan, so we didn't need much, but because it's so lean, it's taken most of it up. Almost all cooked through. So what I'm going to do now is add back most of the onions. Sure you can. Add back most of the onions that we cooked a little bit earlier. Combine them. And remember, this is well seasoned already, and we've been seasoning along as we go. And we've got our onions already browned because we did that separately. It's going to put a little bit of moisture back in. And then, yes you may, and then we've got a can of crushed tomatoes. As you can see, it's not tomato sauce, just super simple crushed tomatoes. And we're going to put most of that can in here. And we've got ourselves a great, it's in here, we're making elk pasta. We've got ourselves a great elk meat sauce ready to be added to our pasta.